Okay, so this is going to be real and raw. Um, I just spent more than an hour on tech support with um, the tech support staff trying to fix my daughter's computer. Um, can't figure it out. Have to take it to the Geek Squad to try to get it fixed. And um, she's furious and freaking out. And, you know, to her, it's all about this game that she wants to play. And she, like, gets on FaceTime and plays. But overall, I'm looking at it as my kid is freaking out because she can't play a game on a computer. And, you know, trying to survive this COVID-19 um, where we can't go anywhere, we're not supposed to let our kids play with anybody else. Um, and I just was like, you know, she's happy, she's fine playing on that computer. Um, and so I'll just go with it since she seems happy. At least she's not miserable and, and I'm scared and freaking out and complaining. Um, but now it's worked against me and now she hardly ever leaves her room. All she does is get on FaceTime with her friends and play the computer and has a meltdown now that her computer has got something wrong with it. So my point here is that parenthood is fucking hard. And if you're a mom or a dad, then you understand what I mean. They don't give you a manual for this shit. How are you supposed to know what the fuck to do? Um, so I guess my tip is, what I'm trying, sitting out here <laughs> trying to tell myself is that we get tied up in first world problems of thinking that everything is so awful, but you know, my child is not sick. My child has food to eat. My child um, is a very sweet child and a creative and smart child. I mean, she, with all my bitching, she ended up with A's and B's at the end of the year, school year. Um, and she is loved and it's gonna be okay. And as much as sometimes we feel like we're failing, the thing about it is no matter how good of a job you do, you're going to find yourself stuck in a place where you're like, what in the hell did I do wrong? I mean, I grew up in a really great household with parents who loved me and they sent me to art school and I still fucked some shit up when I was, <laughs> I mean, I've been married a couple times and I've been in, I was a disaster in my twenties. So, you know, no matter what you do, the thing about life is that the only way that people can learn is to go through shit. And as a parent, as a kid growing up, um, and you know, I talked to my best friend over the weekend and she's having issues with her um, grown daughter and she's just like, I've given this kid everything. Like, I don't even know what's going on. Um, I think there's a lot of things going on in kids' heads with COVID, I mean, and parents' heads too, but I just wanna tell you that you're doing okay. All you gotta do is love your kid. And maybe you don't have a kid, maybe it's just a relationship. All you gotta do is love the other people, love the other person and make sure everybody's safe and it'll all work out. God, even if it doesn't feel like it's going to, just hang in there, do what's next breathe, make it through another day, choose love.